up, eat that food. I spent all day trying to think of, you know, what can I say? To my brother, you know, what stories, you know, come to mind when I think of him. Pretty much spent all day trying to figure out what I would say on the moment. On the moment. Money to zoom out, don't you? So this is me, Namir, her brother, and it's my job to mess with her every so often. It's just our responsibility, you know? So every year on our birthdays, we like to do this thing where we walk down memory lane, memory highway, and we recount the good times, the bad times, the sad times, the times that make us laugh and things. So this is Morgan's take on it. We'll see what she has to say. Let's hit play. When the moment comes, so we started doing this sort of tradition when, you know, whomever's birthday it is, we just say some nice things, things we remember. So like I said, I spent all day trying to figure out what I'd say. And I think my most memorable story is around the time where somehow he unlocked the ability to run on his hands and feet. And in my defense, I did watch a lot of Pokemon and I was obsessed with Pikachu for like 0.5 seconds. So I mean, can you really blame me when anime was life? That's your thing, when he unlocked this Neanderthal, part of his brain where he can run, you know, like a wild animal. So it's around this time, he also was practicing his donkey kicks. Why was he practicing donkey kicks? Beats me, I don't know. And he's just gone on and on, just unprovoked in his room. I can see him from my room just donkey kicking. Okay, so in my defense this time, the same thing is still applicable, but at this time it was Naruto with Rock Lee and Tsunade with the kicks. I mean, who didn't love a good anime? Who didn't love Naruto back then? I was real committed. It's okay. <laughs> so I forgot, I forgot what I needed. So I walk across, because at the time, our rooms were literally just a short distance. You know, point A to B, short distance. Got what I, I have to come and ask him for. I'm thinking he hears me walking as we all hear. You know, because the floor creaks. No, donkey kick, boom, slam, right to the jaw. I said, dang, jaw cracking everything to this day. <laughs> the jaw might crack if I chew on something. I said, what in the world? And then he looks at me. Oh, I'm sorry, Morgan. The damage was done. You done donkey kicked your <laughs> sister. Right smooth in the jaw. What in the world? Are these practicing his survival skills or working on his anger management? You know, I was telling him that, you know, I'm glad he's my older brother. I'm glad to be born into a family where I get a chance to have him as my brother. You know, 25 years, you know, I've been with this guy that I'm just thankful for him. You know, I love him. That's my main man. But I don't know, just when I was recalling stories, the donkey kick came first. And then all around there, you can catch us. Referencing movies, random songs, just a variety of different things. Also, bonus clip, one year, Namir, we're all chilling at home, minding our own business. He's in his room, I'm in my room. It's another store I come back to his room. It's his birthday. So Namir, what you want to do today? He said he wants to go laser tagging. I'm like, oh, okay, you know, that sounds cool. He says he has some friends, too, he wanted to go laser tagging with. Do you guys know that this guy planned his own birthday and, in fact, asked mom to drop him to the laser tag? What was it, about 30 minutes before he was put, 30 minutes before this time slot? Yeah, I definitely organized my own laser tag party and told him at the last minute because I didn't think they was going to let me go. I don't know why I did it that way, but this was definitely around high school. But, hey, you live and you learn. Organized his own party with no ride. He didn't even know. If she, we didn't even know if she had anything else to do. We surely did. <laughs> we surely did. He just asked her, and then she couldn't say no because guess what? All his friends were already there. And so what in the world? What kind of game is this guy running? So we also learned that Namir is very strategic. Um, planned his own surprise party. At least it was a surprise to us. We didn't know it was occurring. 
And so I think we lived about what, 20 minutes away, 20, 25 minutes away at the time from where the place was. We get there, sure enough, all of his friends are there. I just said, what? Anyway, mom gets there, she smiles, pays for all the kids. I said, wow, look at her. Just <laughs> buying all the buying all these people's entry to the laser tag. And so we all laser tag. And it was a good time. And uh yeah, uh, that was my bonus memory. And uh yeah, Namir, I hope you watch this back and say, Wow, I remember those times. Because I know you do. The same way I do. And so happy birthday. Hope you enjoy your 27th birthday. As you know, that means you're how many years? Eight, nine, ten. Three years away from 30. Can you believe it? Time is flying by. Anyway, peace.